Let's go into virtual reality. Hello Rifters and today I'm gonna play a architecture demo and now you may ask like Nathy why the hell are you gonna play a architecture demo? That's a good question. Well, I was looking at the Oculus VR website for fun games to play and I couldn't find anything cool to record for YouTube. But then I saw this demo called Living Vision and in this demo you can walk around in a house and explore it a bit and the screenshots were just amazing so that's why we are gonna do this today and trust me it's not gonna be boring it's gonna be really fun i'm gonna try to entertain you guys while looking around in this house so anyway let's go into virtual reality let's explore this house and as you can see the textures or the graphics are just totally amazing and first of all we're gonna go to the kitchen I'm not gonna do a tour like this is my house because it isn't my house and I'm not trying to sell you this house at all. So here's the kitchen and it looks really really modern. So what you can do here is interact or well change the colors of your furniture like this. So now it's white, now it's black and you can change between colors and that's really nice. If you wanna buy a house and you can change that before you buy it and see like hey this fits or this is not good at all. I should go for the black one Then you can really... Customize your house before buying it. Whoa, this microwave looks really, really expensive. It's called Bauknecht. That sounds really German for some reason. And there's also like a radio above it. Or is that also the microwave? I don't know. <laughs> That's a good question. Like an inbuilt radio at the microwave while you're waiting for your uh, soup or something else. I don't know. Seems legit. That teapot looks extremely huge in my opinion if I'm standing next to it. Someone also drank some coffee. And there's also bread on the table that also looks really huge. I feel like a dwarf somehow. Like, is this a hobbit house? Well, I don't think so because a hobbit house wouldn't look like this. That was the kitchen. Let's go to the next thing. And that's the dinner table. And as you can see, we can also change that to green or red. And if I had to choose, I would go for green. Since the red uh, one really reminds me of a Chinese restaurant. And I'm not sure why. <laughs> Uh, that's a good question. I'm not even sure what the answer on that is. But serious, the candles are the finishing touch on this table and also the sinaasappels. Yeah, we call them sinaasappels in Dutch. Learn that word out of your head. It sounds funny, I know. Um, so anyway, there's also a bookshelf here with a weird flower pot that has to look modern. Some glasses. I think they like to uh, drink a lot of wine or champagne, I don't know. And they also got some books there. And champagne, of course, because, well, look at this house. They have to be rich, you know, or this apartment. Anyway, let's keep going. And those paintings are like everywhere. Here's also like a painting. It's the same one, I guess. Yeah, and there are also like other rooms here. We can't go in there. We can't open any doors. So now the question that is haunting me forever. Can I go up these stairs? Well, I can't. It's blocking my uh, feet from going up the stairs. So let's go to the living part. And as you can see, we can also change something here. And this lamp, oh my god, the reflection on this lamp is just amazing. And it's so red. It's just beautiful. I, I love it. Serious. So let's change the color. It's now yellow. I think it's much better. And the uh, couch is white and the table is also white. But now, I want to change something. Because the uh, couch is white, the table is white. And my... Wait a second, my dinner table wasn't red. I didn't want it to look like a Chinese restaurant. Here we go. So now my uh, chairs at the dinner table are kind of white. And I also want to change my uh, kitchen to white. So the furniture is also white. Now everything is fitting together. That's what I like. So now it's basically complete. This is a weird plant. Where is this coming from? I think my mom would like this. He likes really weird plants. I don't know, but I have the feeling that this plant is going to eat me and that it's kind of mutated. But I don't know. Maybe I have just weird thoughts about it. Anyway, let's go uh, to this... Awesome looking television. Oh my god, and it's called Epic. It's not even Samsung. It's just Epic, you know? So let's turn it on and let's see what happens. In virtual reality. What is in virtual reality? Tell me. Oh, what is this? What is this guy wearing? That's not an Oculus Rift. Matrix Technologies. Serious, what the hell is this? This looks kind of spacey in my opinion. Like, should I also do that with my Rift? Like... Ooh... Virtual reality. Ooh. I don't know, but they uh, seem to enjoy it. This is really Illuminati confirmed. Okay, enough television. Let's go to the fireplace and let's turn it on like these. And oh my god, I want to test it out right now. Like, ooh. I can feel the warmth coming at my hands right now. It's kind of hot. Ooh. 
It's so realistic, I know, it's so, so intense. Looks like we got enough wooden blocks for the upcoming days, but I also saw something really suspicious, and that's this wooden doll. And now we think like, what is it? Well, actually I can't tell much about it, but what I do know is that the IKEA is selling this wooden doll. So maybe this whole house has been designed by the IKEA. I know. Maybe this is a disaster, or maybe this is good news. You can fill it in yourself. I don't know, but this wooden doll tells us enough. So I'm not Sherlock Holmes, but that's my theory for now. Anyway, I saw enough, and I love these kind of apartments, because everything is in one room, and that makes it so cool looking. Anyway, let's go back to reality. So that was my personal tour through this awesome looking apartment and I have to say this was pretty fun and relaxing to explore and I hope you guys liked it because I'm not really used to doing any architecture demo uh, gameplays so I hope you liked it if you liked it then please hit that like button don't forget to subscribe of course if you didn't do it already do you have any tips tricks or suggestions then let me know that in the comments and that's it guys and as always say and I see you guys next time